The Vinci Center in St. Leonard lived up to its name today. 21 young artists from Montreal high schools were painting for a cause. Their challenge, paint a masterpiece for auction in only three hours. Annie DeMelk joins us. Annie, the proceeds actually go to charities that are chosen by the artists themselves. And Tara, the artists collectively chose Dans la Rue as well as Free the Children, which is a non-profit uh, that builds uh, schools in third world countries. And it was a really great opportunity for these young artists not only to do good, but also to share and learn some new skills. It's a beautiful thing to see young artists completely focused so obviously in their element fittingly at the Leonardo da Vinci Center in St. Leonard. Oh, I like uh, Leonardo da Vinci because I like how he painted the uh, Mona Lisa. Inspired by the masters, these students painted for a cause. Their challenge, produce a work of art in just three hours. Their theme, a Mediterranean landscape, real or imagined. I just found this picture on Flickr and I thought it was pretty because it has like a red boat on it. And the boat looks like it's going on a journey. Producing a masterpiece on a deadline can be a bit nerve-wracking. You're looking around and you have all these beautiful paintings. So it's kind of like you're not intimidating yourself. Don't underestimate, don't overestimate. Just paint, have fun. That's it. <laughs> the Daquila twins usually paint in private, but going public definitely has its perks. People are coming up, they're giving us compliments and stuff. I feel like a, a movie star, like look at me, I'm on TV. The students' creations will be on display here at the Leonardo da Vinci Center over the next three weeks and also online on the English Montreal School Board website before being auctioned off for a good cause. Their charities of choice, Dans la Rue and Free the Children, which build schools in third world countries. <laughs> Guest artist Eduardo Roda sees talent here, but more importantly, La Passion Verlal. They have a passion for art, he says. The rest will fall into place. One day, Sabrina D'Aquila hopes to turn her passion into a career. I find art isn't given like the chance as much as science or math and stuff, but art is really important. Like You always have to be creative in your life. Wise words from a 15-year-old expressing herself with every stroke of her brush. Annie DeMelt, CTV News.